In today's Tech Check, teaching kids of all ages, young and old, how to code, or more appropriately, to develop a love of coding and allow it to take root. Coding shouldn't be something just computer scientists do. It should be something everyone can do. And Root makes that possible. It starts with a language so simple that a young child can use it even before they know how to read. If this, then that. Root is a coding robot. It's an idea born out of the robotics lab at Harvard, now on Kickstarter and trying to go mainstream. The company, Scansorial, which means adapted for climbing, says that Root can be an invaluable educational tool from toy to eventually teaching you full text coding languages. You can program it to drive, perform functions on just about any surface. It can magnetically attach to and drive on a whiteboard, even navigate a maze. And it can be programmed to sketch and draw your own creations. It's expected to cost around 199 bucks. Well, here's a news flash for you. Samsung's fire-prone phablet apparently hasn't hurt the company's brand too much. A Reuters Ipsos opinion poll found that current Samsung smartphone users were as loyal to their brand as Apple customers are to the iPhone. It also found that people who knew about the recall were just as interested in Samsung phones as those who did not. This despite the fact that Samsung first recalled and then ultimately pulled the Note 7 from the market because of overheating issues. A lot of talk lately about ludicrous speed in the Tesla Model S P100D. Well, we just told you last week that thanks to a software update, the luxury electric car will be able to go from 0 to 60 in 2.4 seconds. Well, that said, a company in China, Next EV, claims that this car is the fastest electric car in the world. The Neo EP9, oh, it sure looks fast, has a top speed of 194 miles per hour, but 0 to 60, at least from early reports, seem to be a tad slower than Tesla's by three-tenths of a second. But who's counting? That is Tech Check.